<laughs> so so post-religious right means a more diverse leadership, mm -hmm. more diverse agenda. Steve, do you use that language also to talk about the era we're in? No. No, I, I think there's, I don't think that the, that the religious right is gone or dead. I mean, the language, we may call it something different, but, and I think what there is is a generational change in leadership, that the, that the traditional leaders of the religious right are passing the torch, sometimes willingly, sometimes unwillingly, to a new generation of evangelical leaders, and that the voters and that rank and file evangelical voters have different interests than their parents did. Mm -hmm. That there is a really interesting generational, some interesting generational differences. So the kind of religious conservative movement will look different in terms of who's leading it and uh, what its emphasis is than five years ago. But there still will be a very large core of conservative religious Americans emphasizing conservative religious uh, and moral issues in, in politics. I don't think, and I don't think their their impact and influence uh, has has waned. The other thing that's happened is there is now more of a counterpoint to it. That there's, you know, that the to underline the the point On Jim the was making. He's saying end of the spectrum. when Jim was saying the there was a religious right monologue. What's changed is the addition, to some degree, of someone else in the conversation. Mm -hmm. 